after being scratched by radioactive buckthorn, bitten by a radioactive emerald ash borer, and periodically slipping and falling into radioactive recycling bins, mild-mannered Johnny Burnsville was transformed into Sustainability Man. Now faster than compost, taller than a rain barrel, and more powerful than an LED light bulb, Sustainability Man uses his sustain ability to seek out sustainable resources, energy efficiency, and green programs. This week's episode... I am Sustainability Man. I have come to Burnsville in search of green projects and sustainable resources. Today, I am joined by Tom Kaki, <laughs> Operations Manager for the nonprofit Woodhill Urban Egg. Tom Kackman, thank you so much. Nice to meet you, Mr. Sustainability Man. Thank you for being here. You betcha. Today, we are in front of the Community Garden at Woke Park in Burnsville. And Tom Kackman, can you please tell our audience, what is a community garden? A community garden is where you have a situation like this where you have more than one person coming together to garden. Um, in this particular case, we've got 48 plots here. This is a mandala garden, by the way. It's built in a circle. These are common around the world, but not very common in the United States. Um, the idea being, when you come out to your garden, if it's a regular grid system, you can come to your garden and not really, you can avoid people. Um, the way this is built in a circle, you're forced, as you're coming into your garden and finding your plot, you're forced to bump into other people. So it creates, creates more of a social atmosphere. So not only are you growing food sustainably, right. but you're growing community as That's well. That's the idea behind it, yep. Now what is the benefit of a community garden? Well, it brings people together for a common purpose. Anytime you have something in common, whether you're riding a Harley motorcycle, book club, whatever, we're all gardening, we all have common interests, so we all have something in common we can talk about. Now, of course, Sustainability Man is about sustainability. You might have been able to tell from the I, name. I guess that. Why is a community garden sustainable? Well, it can be sustainable. It takes work. It has to be someone committed or several people committed to be able to create this year after year. Right over here, we've got a compost bin, which is overflowing at this time. We'll come back, we'll grind that up, we'll, so it'll be easier to decompose, but that's really what makes gardening sustainable. If you want something sustainable, you really want to keep it self-contained. You don't want to have to go outside of yourself to get more products. We'll come back and we'll be able to spread that on our uh, sites as a fertilizer so you're not going out and buying fertilizer. We're, we're all organic here. We don't want to bring in any pesticides, any herbicides, any fertilizers. That would, of course, affect the sustainability. Correct. Now, your organization has two community gardens in Burnsville, one in Minneapolis, but there are multiple community gardens around the community, around the metro area. Tell us, how does one get involved in community gardens? In this particular case, you sign up with the city, you pay your $40, they will issue you a plot, and then that's your plot throughout the summer. In this particular case, you get two plots. You get what's called a, a circular garden and then a field garden. So this would be for your smaller crops, herbs, things that don't take up a lot of room. This would be for your squashes, tomatoes, beets, things that take up more room. Now, Tom Kackman, before I let you leave today, Tell us, what is your favorite thing about community gardens? So what I really liked is to see people interact with each other, where someone that's got more experience can come alongside of someone that has maybe never done it before and show them how to do it. Tom Kackman, thank you very much for joining me today. And remember, until next time, you too can use your sustainability.